Wherever love goes, there is also misery. It's no mystery. And you and I, we got history. Yeah. to have you back again with me today for my second wig video i'm so happy and grateful that you guys loved the first one you know it was really uh, welcome it was well received um i was really skeptical about uploading or uh, and recording that video but i'm so happy that you enjoyed it and are asking me for more so here we are we officially now have a wig series going on on our channel yay I'm so excited so guys i'm sorry I already recorded this part, but the whole time I was talking, it wasn't recording. So now I have to do it all over again, and I have already got the wig out of the box. So we're just gonna we're gonna get into it. My baby get... today, as you can tell from the title, is from Outre. This is her. Her name is Brooklyn. Um, I chose this wig because um, it's just my style. I like my side parts, and I like my hair with a bit of length. To them and that is honestly really why I chose this wig and I went for the wig in the color one because I was just trying to play it safe um, this time of year I like to wear dark hair dark makeup dark clothing it's it's just how I like it so I thought you know I, I can't go wrong with the color one so I went for a color one to play it safe. she came you know in the bag as they always do you know in the box as they always do and she had the black uh, net wrapped around her as they always do so the wig itself this is her and i love her already i say i love her because i love the texture just like my previous wig i reviewed she is also a light yaki texture and i feel like yaki texture wigs are more realistic for uh women of color as opposed to the overly silky one um the luster on this wig is actually spot on it's not shiny it doesn't look synthetic it looks quite realistic it looks like hair that's been relaxed or like um uh, straightened or blow dried out so I, li I really like that about this i like the curls it comes with already it looks really luscious quite sexy curls on point um she is a lace front and it is a swiss lace uh front wig so i again i love i love that about the wig i like swiss laces i feel like they're they're more durable and I like them for that reason. So cap construction on Brooklyn, we have got two combs in the front, um, one very close to the part and the other one a bit further away. And I quite appreciate the wigs uh, with the combs done this way in the front because when you have the combs too close together in the front, fair enough, you, you, get, you get to have your wig laying flat where the part is, but then the sides of your, of your wig tend to lift up and it's not a very sexy look do you know what i mean but with the comb spread a bit further apart like this you're able to pull the wig taunt taut is it taut or taunt you know what i mean pull it nice and tight in the front before you you know hinge the clip in and that way it's not flapping open uh, on the sides um and then at the back at the nape of the wig we have one comb and we have our adjustable straps the part on the wig is an l part it's a nice deep l part it's a good length to it and a good width again i'm just going to come in and show it to you like i did in the previous video and this is the part this part is a lot wider than the one in the previous video so there realistically shouldn't be a reason for you to pluck this part at all i don't think if you ask me but the only thing that i will do and i'm going to do off camera now is i'm going to put my face powder on the inside like i did previously i'm going to cut off the lace and i shall come back with this beautiful baby on my head so i'll see you guys in a minute so this is brooklyn on my head um i just cut off the the lace and i put some powder on the part and that's all i done to it i didn't comb her or brush her out or anything and she's pretty much like a shake and go wig like you literally can throw this on your head and be out the door i love it i love i love the style i love the texture um just running my fingers through it after i put it on um there are a couple of strands come out already but i suppose again that is expected it's not it's like it's not a ridiculous amount of hair it's only a couple of strands hopefully you know she doesn't end up shedding like a you know? yeah she looks absolutely lush and i like the length it's a good like 18 inches i'd say probably 18 20 down to 
my boob area for me and I am five foot four inches tall so it's a good length it's a good decent length she's not ridiculously long um, very manageable length and yeah I love it it, should, it doesn't feel heavy on the head you don't even feel like you got anything on well of course you got hair but you know it's not heavy um, as far as the cat being big head friendly um, again it's not particularly accommodating same as the last one if your head is any bigger than what mine is it will be a bit of a struggle to have this on I took the straps off at the back she feels really snug I only use the combs to hold her down and it's it's quite secure but if your head is any bigger than mine it might be a bit of a struggle to put this wig on and keep it but yeah man yes my people I'm in love I love her I love her I'll trade on really well with this beauty right here this beauty right here she is gorgeous she is divine I'm feeling myself with this wig um, I'm not going to comb up the hair at this point because I don't feel like I need to. Yeah. Nice bit of volume to it and everything. I love it. I love it. All right, guys. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Is she a yay or an A? I think for the party season, she would be absolutely gorgeous to put on. This is a lovely, lovely hairstyle for the party season. So on the care card... As always, you know, your care instructions and how to put it on and everything else is there. Um, it does say on the car that you can use heat on her up to 400 degrees. Um, I will advise not to go as high. A little bit below that would be really good just so you don't end up frying or melting or burning the hair off because at the end of the day it is still synthetic hair so you want to be careful with that and she comes in a variety of colors. So that is pretty much it I think for Brooklyn um if there if, if you have any question please don't hesitate to leave it in the in the comment section below this one came costs me oh I'm not quite sure but I'll leave the price across the screen right now how much I had to pay for it guys I hope that you enjoyed this video as always thank you so much for taking the time out to watch this video I do appreciate all of you and if you are new here if this is your first time seeing this face Thank you for choosing to watch this video um please be sure to hit the subscribe button before you leave because i would love for you to become a part of the family if you've got any questions you know anything at all you want to address please leave them in the comment section below i always make the effort to reply to everyone's comments so please don't hesitate to do that and i cannot wait to see you in the next one all right guys as always be good stay safe take care of yourself folks and i'll catch you real soon thanks for watching bye all the pain